you guys i started a live video and then i had to turn it back off and go set the set the wife of my other phone because this one is in landscape and i cannot see your comments so hopefully this one works so um okay i have my other phone here i will be reading your comments from this let's do this Why is it upside down? You guys? I'm looking at myself upside down. Hold on. Oh boy. Okay. So we need to fix this. Permit me fix this. That is very sloppy. Hold on. Let me know in the comments if you can see me. Sh um, if this is looking okay. Now I have to adjust the entire thing. Oh my God. I'm so sorry, you guys. I apologize. I still don't have a handle on this whole life thing. You would think after two after three lives i would just come on and everything would be very smooth no not me <laughs> okay that is so much better i'm so sorry okay so today i'm just gonna go let me shut the door it's so noisy jesus christ Can it get any worse than this? If I don't take good time by Missy, but you spent what? Good time by Missy, will it last? Darling, of course it'll last. The only thing is, uh, okay, thank you. The only thing is, um, the minute you stop using the fan while you are going to reverse fast, you still will reverse with glutathione but you will reverse slower but that is not let's not digress say i know you've said you must take vitamins absolutely darling absolutely you have to take your vitamins absolutely now glutathione i have come to understand that glutathione is not a must but your vitamins is a must and you have to find supplements that work for you okay so today i'm gonna talk to you guys about lightning shower gel just like you see in the title so i have my lightning shower gel here no it is not for sale um before i continue i like i said before or i have said a couple of times i i reversed really bad so i am starting i am restarting my journey almost from scratch if you ask me but um I'm not gonna despair right so I have lost right now I'm look. I think I've lost like three shades right now so I'm um, um, people will say I'm not super dark, but I think I am I also broke out on my face my past period made me broke out really bad as you can see I have like really bad acne scars all of this is on the three weeks I was something was happening to me it was terrible my face was really really bad um, that's why I didn't come on live last week and my face was swollen. I think I had allergy or I ate something. I'm not sure what it is. And then I started picking on them. So it left me this bad scarring. But I'm showing you this so we can all track my progress. I know. I'm showing you this so we can all track my progress. I got some new products and I'm going to try a new face cream so we can all look at it together on every live video and see if I'm making any progress. I also have some on this side. Um, yes, I have a little, and then I have a few dots on my chest. So we're gonna work on it together, I'm excited. So about the soap, um, 
mommy t says i have scarring on my neck oh doll, i'm so sorry yes we're gonna work on it together and try to see if the soap and the lotion mixtures and the glycerin is gonna fix it and also today i will be showing you how to mix a very strong glycerin lightning glycerin i have all my stuff here so just stay put <sighs> okay mm -mm -mm. no you're welcome mommy t okay so i forgot i don't have my black soap because i used it all so i'm just gonna tell you about the black soap okay so this is my whitening shower gel like i said before it is not for sale this container is a container that i bought what did i buy on this container um i'm drinking stella rosa <laughs> i'm drinking stella rosa black this is not a sponsor video stella rosa call me <laughs> <laughs> i'm drinking stella rosa black just a disclaimer do not drink if you were below the age of 21 don't drink and drive drink responsibly please i want you to see my my embellishment of my pillow so i'm just gonna fix it so you can see it yay <laughs> okay so i'm this soap right here this is a 500 ml container 26 i don't drink much girl i wish I, I couldn't but like uh half a glass of wine is not that bad and it's good for your health at least half a glass every week is good for your health so this black soap right here i'm sorry it's a combination of other soaps i have hair on my mouth it won't come out <laughs> oh my gosh okay i got it so um I'm going to show you how to mix this whitening soap. Girl, you and me both. I don't know if I ever said, but I have a son. I have a grown son. My son is 11. He's the cutest baby in the whole world. He's a grown up, but I said, come my baby. I don't know why. Anyway, let me, let's talk about this soap, girl. So we don't have to stay here for an hour like we did the last time. That was exhausting. Okay, so this lightening this this is a very strong lightening soap dare i say a whitening soap if you ask me so i'm gonna tell you how i made it how i made it what you need to make it and everything um mommy t i don't talk about my like i'm i really try to keep my personal life out of social media you would never know if i don't say anything but yeah i i can relate as being a single mom i totally can so the first ingredients you will need for this lightening shower gel is black soap so personally it doesn't matter if you're using ghana black soap or if you're using the black soap black soap which is a nigerian black soap if you're using moroccan black soap or if you're using um dudu osun black soap it doesn't matter you just need a good quantity of black soap so this is the end result i'll tell you how i got this so secondly you have to melt the soaps you have to melt your soap to be able to turn it to a shower gel and how do you melt it i'll explain it to you but first let's start with all the ingredients that you will need so you will need your black soap which is one please get a pen and a paper so you can write this down i'm just going to give you a few minutes to get a pen and a paper before i continue okay so you would need your black soap which is one and then you will need other soaps okay you will need other soaps so these are the soaps that i choose to use that i chose to use you can use any soap of your choice it's lacking one soap i had five soaps you can choose any other soap of your choice so uh, all right so i'm gonna show you the soaps the first one which is the strongest i'll show you the first two that is the strongest of all the soaps the first one is the pimandu plus soap right here so pimandu uh, it says treatment and lightening with uh, fruit acid <laughs> 
acid fruits. French people, they like, this is from my country, Cameroon. They don't know how to translate in English. So they just do like direct Google translation. Acid, the fruit is fruit acid, but they like acid fruits. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so you will need Pimandu Plus. Make sure there's Pimandu Plus. You see that I'm trying to hide my nails. This is embarrassing. Anyway, so you can see Pimandu Plus right there. So make sure that you get the one that says plus. And then you will need half of this. I'm doing half because I'm the only one that is, that's using it. And even when I used the half, it was still, it still came out. I had like um, 500, 500, 500. I had at least 1000 ml worth of shower gel. So you can use half of this or even chop it into three, one, one third of it. And then the next strong soap um, will be glutathione blanchisseur. The next strong soap will be this soap right here, glutathione blanchisseur. I think I missed a comment. Let me see. Other products I had to find. Are you in the US? I can help out if you're in the US. I have someone that sells products like this. And for the ones that you cannot find, there's a beauty supply store not far from me. I can help you buy them but only if you're in the u.s and you can pay for your shipping i'll get them for you okay then that works um i will drop my ig um how do you pin something i'm gonna try to pin my ig um may 65 skin i say 66 instead of 65 guys please help me how do you how do you pin a comment oh pin message there you go okay so the next thing you need is savon blanchisseur by glutathione it says super eclaircissant which translate strong lightening is very very lightening i know thank you <laughs> So this soap is very big. I have used this soap twice, so the, the, the pack is empty. Um, in my last soap that I made, I had this glutathione soap in it. So you need half of this. And then the next soap, which is also a very strong soap, but it's not super duper strong. This is a soap from Thailand. Um, this is a Philippine soap, sorry. So, and it retails for $4.50, as you can see on there. This is called Silka Papaya. So, there's different types of Silka soap, but this one is the papaya one. I choose to go with this. It says this is a whitening herbal soap. Let's check out the ingredients. It has salicylic acid. It has papaya enzyme, which is what I'm going for. Enzymes are the best. They're anti-aging, they're skin lightening, they reduce blemishes, and they reduce um like melasma and other skin blemishes. And it also has tocopherol acetate. Whenever you see tocopherol acetate, that is vitamin C, vitamin E, sorry. So this is um, Silka Papaya Whitening Soap. Hi, Tesla. Thank you for joining us. I was wondering when you were going to come on. I was like, I haven't seen Tesla. <laughs> so I used half of it. This is the half. It smells nice. I won't lie. It smells so nice. So they have the cucumber. They have other uh, fruits, fruity soaps, but I choose to go with papaya. So if you look at all my fruities, my AHA soaps, you'll see that they're all fruit base or plants base because those are the most effective so aside from silica that is your third soap you will need your my fourth soap is la bijanes la bijanes a la carotte this one's la bijanes carrot this is a very very strong lightening soap but it's mild on the skin you know some soaps are strong lightening but they're not mild on the skin but this one is mild on the skin so it's not gonna like some of our be made up it's not gonna like ruin your skin or anything so you will need half of this um because i was making a huge quantity i used one third of it so i have used this soap three times this is the half that is left in the pack this also smells okay <laughs> 
So the main ingredients here is carrots. Let's check the ingredients on this. This has um, AHAs, alpha hydroxyl acid. It has carrot extract. It has zinc oxide. It has lauric acid. I don't know what lauric acid is, but it works. <laughs> and the last soap, I feel like I'm missing one thing. Oh no, it's just a soap. Okay. Um, I feel like I'm missing something. Okay, I got it here. So the last soap on the list will be um the Janet Bisap Clarifying Soap. This is a soap here, Janet Bisap Clarifying Soap. This soap um is an exfoliating soap. Uh it says super goma, super goma goma is in French, it means exfol exfoliate so it says super goma and they try to translate as well super gumming <laughs> they're just trying to say it's super exfoliating it says super exfoliant um let's find the ingredients in this one this one contains fruit acid it contains plant extract it contains abutin alpha abutin it contains clay and glycerin um it has a very beautiful color it has like a pinkish color this is it, it has like a deep red or magenta pink it's so pretty it smells it doesn't smell nice <laughs> so those are your five soaps that you would need and now let's pass on to the next thing that you will also need uh six soaps because if we have to include the black soap so you need your black soap of course a good quantity you need more black soap than any of these other soaps so the next thing you will need is some milk let me get my milk um, you will need goat milk. Mm. So I'm going to come back to the comments in a minute. You will need goat milk. I got this goat milk from Lotion Crafters. This is one pound of goat, goat milk, not meat. I'm sorry. <laughs> this is one pound of goat milk. This is full cream goat milk powder. This is the powder. Um, some people like to go with the liquid, but I would not advise to go with the liquid because if if you go with the liquid the your soap it would it kind of ruins stuff because it's liquid so go with the powder so you will need your goat milk powder this was not too expensive it was about nine or ten dollars from lotion crafters okay let me take a sip while i respond to the comments real quick mm. Nash Tab says, I'm starting to use Caro White and want to I want you be okay. I want to be your skin complexion. Can I achieve that with continuous use of the lotion? I'm very dark skin. Okay, you will ruin your skin if you if you use continuously. Um, um, so the first thing I'll tell you is don't keep the caro white aside for now and exfoliate with AHA. Oh, mommy is leaving. Oh, mommy T. So, um, don't use Caro White for long. Caro White is a product. Oh, thank God. I was like, no, don't go. <laughs> Caro White is a product that you will use for two weeks, maximum three weeks. Do not use Caro White more than three weeks. I am begging you. Do not use Caro White more than three weeks. So, because you are very dark skin, like you said, I would advise that you start with AHA exfoliation before you move to Caro White. Remind me in the comments when I'm done with this recipe, I will tell you what to do because I don't want to um, interrupt the recipe. I'm sorry, my darling. Just remind me when I come to the end of it, let me tell you what to do. Okay, so I have showed you the soaps. I've showed you the goat milk. Let's move on to the next thing that you will need. I know I was forgetting something. I'm forgetting two things. Um, you guys, hold on. Let me go grab those containers. I know I was forgetting something. I just didn't know what. <sighs> okay, I found it. All right. Do you see how I dress to go out? 
I wear, I cover my body extensively. The only parts that are exposed, I put sunscreen on. My pants are super long. They're literally dragging on the floor. So I advise that you always cover your body when you are going out. Don't try to look cute or sexy under the sun. You will ruin your hard work. Okay, so the next thing that you need is, thank you, baby. The next thing you need is shampoo. You need Dub shampoo. I don't know if you've heard that this Dub shampoo is very good for skin lightening. In fact, is this Dub, this shampoo is for skin bleaching, not even skin lightening. So you need Dub shampoo. You need one, depending on how strong you wanna make it, you can put two, but do not go above two, please. So you have your Dub shampoo right here. The next thing you will need excuse me the next thing you will need is you will need one full bottle of la 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 the brown one there's two there's three la 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 there's the green one there is the there's the yellow one the orangey one and then there's the the brown one so this is the brown one you will need the brown la 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 uh it's a an exfoliating lotion you will need the ex the exfoliating la 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 one whole bottle don't try to be stingy else it won't work the soap won't work i'm trying to bring the camera a little closer okay the next thing you will also need is lactic acid my lactic acid here i, I love this tiny little gallons <laughs> you will need lactic acid i got this lactic acid from lotion crafters right here you need lactic acid um, this is 90% lactic acid and I will tell you the measurements. So the next thing you will need is you will need two serums of your choice. Any serum, any strong lightening serum of your choice. Um, I choose to go with gold skin. This serum is, um, can you see the price, man? I just spilled stuff over it. So I choose to go with gold skin and i go with gold skin because it has snail slime in it and snail slime is <laughs> snail slime is um uh, really really good for your skin as you can see oh i will show you the front side above this cargo is snail slime as you can see it says snail slime on it snail slime is good for your skin it helps with uh rapid skin cell regeneration um also it helps with um what's it called with blemishes and dark spots this serum is extremely powerful it's not up to ten dollars um mommy tea so let me see <laughs> how much is that so i can yeah it's between eight to ten dollars it's not more than ten dollars it's not i just i kind of ruined it i spilled stuff on it so i can't really see the price but it's not more than ten dollars um you need two serums. So this is my first serum. You're very welcome. My first serum is Gold Skin. So Gold Skin has an, an Argan serum. You can go with either one, but I choose this one. This one, I think it works for me even better. Mm, can I put this on spots on my face? I would never advise anyone to put serums directly on their face. But you can, you can mix it with maybe jojoba oil because jojoba oil is what i use on my face mix it with jojoba oil but a little bit of jojoba oil and then you dump if you need have to put it on your face then you put it but i will not advise it honestly it's too strong for the face so the next serum that i will add that i added in my liquid my bleaching liquid soap is skin free milk <laughs> who do I, I mean if you don't know about skin free milk i'm not sure what you've been doing but skin free milk is super strong it is not lightening it's not whitening it is bleaching i'm gonna say this really clearly so i don't get questions after do not put skin free milk directly on your skin do not put skin free milk directly on your face don't oh i have a low battery sorry don't put skin free milk in don't use a large quantity of skin-free milk in your glow oil. I see people using one whole bottle of skin-free milk in 500 ml of oil. That will ruin your skin. Don't use this in your glow oil. If you have to use it, use one tablespoon for 
500 ml of glow oil do not use more than one tablespoon if you think you want to overdo it do not go more than two tablespoons even though that is too much so i put because this is a wash off product i put two tablespoons if it was a leave-on product i would have put one tablespoon of skin free milk so two tablespoons of skin free milk right here the next thing you will need is your vitamin E oil. Any vitamin E oil is okay. Want me to know about <laughs> skin free milk? Girl, it's a good thing you don't know about it because before people learn about skin free milk, they have ruined their skin with it. So it's good you don't know about it. <laughs> so you need um, 20 drops of your vitamin E oil. Okay. Um, what is the next thing you will need? um i did show you guys the assets the next thing you need is you will need red palm oil girl i don't even think there are any african beauty supply stores over in seattle so you will need your african red palm oil it's right here i'm going to tell you the quantity that you will need and you will need extra virgin olive oil so here is the kicker you don't have to have these two you can either have the red palm oil or you have the extra virgin olive oil. If you have both of them, wonderful. But if you don't have them, you can either use the olive oil or you can use your red palm oil. But you don't have to use both of them. I just wanted you guys to be, to be able to have options. And then the last thing you will need is piping hot water. So what would you do? You would shred all your soaps. You have the soaps here. You will shred all your soaps, your black soap and your five lightening and exfoliating soaps. You will shred all those soaps. Um, the brand of, I bought it at the African store, uh, Trudy. Hi, Miss Trudy. I bought it at the African store. So you, but you can use any type of red palm oil. It doesn't really matter because it's for the skin. Oh, let me explain why you need red palm oil. Red palm oil is a good supply of um, beta carotene and um, it also has vitamin E in it. Palm, red palm oil will give your skin a nice glow and elasticity. It restores moisture to your skin. It's an emollient. Um, is it humectant or that thing that locks in moisture? That's in glycerin as well. That's what is in red palm oil. It is super good for your skin. It, it's anti-inflammatory. It's anti-reactions for creams. And it also fades black spots. And it also works for eczema and other skin conditions. Always put red palm oil in all your mixtures. I put red palm oil in my shea butter, in my shea butter mixture. So I'm going to do a live video about that some other time. So the first thing you do when you shred all your soaps, you need piping hot water. You, you pour, um, you take a good quantity of your milk, any quantity that you want. I'm not too much into measuring things because I'm not good at math. So I do two tablespoons, three tablespoons. So for this, you need four tablespoons of your powdered goat milk. Just put it dry. Um, put it dry and then mix it in the soap. You take boiling hot water. That water should be so hot. If you boil your water at 360 or 80 degrees, it should be piping hot. Pour the hot water in the soaps. Allow them to melt. Allow them to melt normally. If it's not melting in time, then you can take your hands to kind of like just squish them. Squish them in. Melt them. If you have a hand blender, that is the part where you use the hand blender to blend it, which is what I did. But everything didn't, it wasn't quite smooth, but it's okay. So when you do that, this is the end result. This is what you get. This is the soaps, the black soap, the five lighting and exfoliating soaps, and the good milk. This is what you get. So this right here is just the soaps and the milk. For someone that does not want to bleach their skin, I propose that you stop here. You can stop here, and then you use this on your skin. It's just gonna brighten your skin, it's gonna give you a nice glow, but this is not an immediate product. You have to use it for at least two to three months, and you have to use it correctly before you start seeing results.
so if you just want brightening if you just want a glow to your skin and you should just exfoliate your skin you will stop here with the soaps and the milk the only thing you need to add is the red palm oil and the olive oil you will stop here but if you are like me and mommy t that want to bleach our skin <laughs> that want to do the proper skin lightening continue watching this video now this is the interesting part when you have your liquid like this make sure you allow it to cool down completely you do not want to mix serums and acids and stuff into hot soaps it will kill the serums it will kill the part of the acids and everything in it is not gonna work so make sure you allow the soap to cool down to room temperature before you start adding your ingredients <laughs> okay so the first thing you have to add there is no order to add in this but i will advise that you add your dub shampoo first since as it's soapy you pour all the shampoo in there you mix you mix you mix the next thing you add you add your la 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 an entire bottle of la 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 uh, the next thing you add five tablespoons of 90 percent lactic acid just like that you will need one whole bottle of gold skin serum or any serum that you choose this is a serum that i choose you need one whole bottle an entire bottle you cannot afford to be stingy with this mixture it will not work you need an entire bottle of gold skin or any serum that you want any serum of your choice you will need two tablespoons of skin free milk you will need 20 drops of vitamin E right there. You will need, where's my red palm oil? You will need three tablespoons of red palm oil. And then last but not the least, you will need two tablespoons of extra uh, virgin olive oil. So if you don't have red palm oil, you put five tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. If you don't have olive oil, you put five tablespoons of red palm oil. But if you have both of them together, you put three tablespoons of red oil, you put two tablespoons of olive oil. And this will be the finished product right here. You have your liquid soap, your bleach, your whitening liquid soap right here. Now, this is how you use this soap. You have to use this soap correctly. If not, this soap will not work. It's just going to be another soap that you made. This is how you use the soap. You get into the shower, you wet your body, you put the soap in your hand, you lather it like that, you apply it on your body. I think, I feel like I should demonstrate, even though this is dangerous, because I'm, I'm gonna be showering in like three hours. So this is my soap. Oh, that's a lot, that's a lot of soap. Okay, so this is my soap right here. I'm gonna do this, but I have to wet my skin. I'm gonna wet my skin. I'm gonna apply it on my skin like that, like a lo like a lotion, but except it's gonna be it's gonna have it's gonna have some lather to it. I'm gonna apply it on my skin, all over my skin. After I've wet my skin, I'm gonna apply it, apply it all over my skin. I'm gonna wait 15 minutes, not one minute less. I have to wait 15 minutes. And then I get back in the shower and take my shower normally with this same soap. So that is a procedure to use this soap. If you don't let this soap sit on your body for 15 minutes, it is not going to work. And you will start seeing results. This, you'll start seeing results from the soap with your lotions and everything in about a month or a month and a half. Okay. So um, what else am I leaving out of that soap? Okay, I'm going to tell you something else that you can do with this soap. This is very, very dangerous. Do not quote me anywhere. I am a self-certified guinea pig. I test things on my body. I am not a doctor. I am not a specialist. I did not go to school for any of these things that I'm showing you. I have no proof whatsoever. I'm just trying things and I'm sharing it with you. 
with that being said i'm gonna show you a very dangerous way that is very effective but is very very risky this soap you can use it as a lotion at night if you want very very fast results but this is dangerous don't do it wink wink don't do it but yeah you can use this as a lotion at night you take your shower do whatever you want to do then you take this same soap on a dry skin you see how i just did it on a dry skin you lather and lather and use it as a lotion on your skin properly and you go to bed when i tell you that you will become so white like a wall gecker or like a, a baby lizard so but it's dangerous don't do it for too long once you get your desired results please stop and the other thing about this soap is you've seen that i've put a lot of acids in it there's um la 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 has acids in it um there's hydroquinone in it there's actual acid in it so the other thing that you have to do is to moisturize your skin heavily which means with your um with your lotion you have to use your lighting lotion and during the day you have to absolutely use moisturizer yes mommy t maintain 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 with your butters you have to feed your skin because all these lightening products they take from your skin they make your skin very dry so you have to feed your skin food for the skin is butters you have to give your feed your skin with so much butters moisturizers and everything and i will show you some stuff that i got from burlington which i think you don't have to get the exact same things but if you can get something close to this it is wonderful so um, my table is a mess but when i'm about to start demonstrating the next thing i'm gonna move my camera a little bit so you guys can see so the next thing i'm gonna show you will be how to make a lightening or strong whitening glycerin because you need your glycerin okay and then i'm gonna show you the stuff that i picked up from Burlington. so can we sit on our knees and elbows to bleach absolutely absolutely you can leave the soap on your knees and your elbows but for your knees and your elbows because they're extra strong you will need to wrap them with serene wrap serene wrap so when you apply it on your knees take a serene wrap wrap them and then if you have a socks like a thigh height sock take it and put it over it and then make sure every time you exfoliate your knees scrub on it don't don't pity it beauty is pain scrub on it but do not hurt yourself don't like let your skin come off because then you'll be hurting yourself and it's just gonna burn and you become even more dark but exfoliate real good um what else about this soap that i wanted to say so this soap does not naturally does you're very welcome on me tea. this soap naturally does not smell too nice but if you want you can add a few drops of essential oils in there to make it smell the way you want to it all depends on you but when you're using this soap especially if you use you use the method of using the soap as a lotion and sleep with it overnight you need to moisturize your skin the next morning with a butter or you find any good firming collagen lotion okay so now we're going to pass on to making this lightening glycerin i'm gonna show you all the things that you need guys let's just pray my phone doesn't go off because i've had signals of low batteries let's just do this real quick and pray that my phone does not go off um okay so this is my bowl of stuff that i'm gonna be using for this lightning glycerin the first thing you need um glycerins of course <laughs> So you guys, let me just move the camera a little so you can see my, my workstation here, aka my table. So let me know if you can see properly. There's so much stuff on top of the table, it's not even funny. Uh, I'm gonna take the batteries out, the phone out, of course. I use that to read your comments. Okay. Let me know if you can see properly. Wonderful. Okay. So these are the soaps. I think we're done with those. So right here, I forgot to mention, this is uh, 500 ml worth of soap. So I have 500 
1,000 and five and another 500 ml right here so i have a total of 1500 ml worth of soap this will last me for about two months okay so you need a bowl like this don't mind the knife it's just to open this by our container you need a bowl you need a funnel you need a spoon i don't even know why i have this spoon but i just like to act like i'm measuring stuff <laughs> so I'm going to show you the glycerines that I'm using today for this. The first glycerin that I'll show you is the Fair & White. I think I've shown you this glycerin before. It's the Fair & White um, Exclusive Whitenizer Glycerin. It's a, it has a very beautiful bottle. So that's the first glycerin. Um, the second glycerin will be my 55H Plus Crystalline Strong Lightening Glycerin. I love to call it in French, they can say Ash Plus. It's a very strong bleaching glycerin and it's really good. So that's the new one. I have the, the old one here, which I'll be pouring everything as well. The third thing you will need is your Bio Eclat uh, Triple Action Carrot Glycerin. This is on eBay. It's about 19 or 20 something dollars. Okay, you guys, I apologize. I had a call. I had to reject the call and then the video just went kaboom on me. Okay, so this one right here, you can get it from eBay, of course. So we're just going to go and start real quick. So this is my bio oil container. This is 200 ml. Um, so I'm just going to use it. I have a little bit of bio oil in there, but that's good. It's bio oil. What, what how can I do? So this is the reason why I have the knife to take this cover off. So I'm just going to do that right now before I forget. You want to be really careful. If you can do this without a knife, even better. Don't be like me. <laughs> okay, I need to put it where I will not forget. I'm going to put it over there with the batteries. Okay. So the last thing you need is vegetable glycerin. And I'll tell you why you need vegetable glycerin. It's black. Oh, it's back. Oh, okay. All right. So, can you see me? Please let me know if you can see me. Okay, thank you, Mommy T. So, you need vegetable glycerin, and I'll tell you why you need this natural vegetable glycerin. And this one is an option. Okay. So, you just pour stuff according to how you want them. There is really not no specific measurement so i use more 55 h plus glycerin than any other glycerin um i'm gonna bring the camera a little close so you can you're able to see okay so i use 55 h plus glycerin more than any other glycerin so i'm gonna pour that one in here it's just a little quantity that was left so i'm gonna pour it i'm gonna pour everything in there like that okay so the next one that i'll need is my fair and white exclusive whitenizer glycerin with vitamin c okay i'm gonna pour some of that adjust your phone mommy t turn it vertically oh yes you have to turn your phone some way i don't know mommy t so i just pour until i'm satisfied i don't have a particular measurement for this so just pour until your ancestors tell you to stop you know the same way as black people we pour spice into our food that's exactly what i do with my glycerin <laughs> so i'm just gonna pour that pour it keep pouring keep pouring keep pouring okay i thought that was a good time to stop okay all right so we have that in there. Mommy T, can you see now? So I'm gonna go in with my Bio Eclat uh, Triple Action Carrot um, Glycerin. It has a little nice cover on there. This one actually smells nice. So it's yellowish. So I'm gonna pour a good amount a good quantity in there 
Again, I am not measuring. I cannot measure for shit. I'm sorry, I'm cursing. I cannot measure to save my life. So I just pour my stuff in there the way that I want it until I'm satisfied. Okay. All right, that, that was a good quantity. Okay. So we have that one in there. <laughs> oh boys and the mothers they always want all the one their mom to themselves all the time so well, i'm just gonna stir this real good you see how the colors are coming together because that carrot um glycerine had a nice orangey color so i'm just gonna stir this i really want you to see what i'm doing you're welcome, Mommy T. <laughs> so I'm just gonna stir this real good like that. So if you want a strong lightening or whitening glycerine, this is what you will use, right? This is exactly what you will use. But if you want to tone it down a little, if you don't want it to be super strong, that's when you will go in with your vegetable glycerine. You put one tablespoon of your vegetable glycerine. This is a good moisturizer, but then all of them are good moisturizers. <clears throat> so if you don't want it to be super duper strong, like I want it, you will add one tablespoon of vegetable glycerine or even two tablespoons of vegetable glycerine. <clears throat> but you know me, I am not going to be doing that. I'll, I'll probably just put like a drop or two or three. Okay, that's good. That is it. <laughs> okay so i'm just gonna stir that up so we want to always make sure that we have vitamin e in our mixtures so i'm gonna put 10 drops no five drops of vitamin e one two oh i'm back in the camera sorry um three four five cold cold beans all right and just stir some more and now it's time to pour it into my container i got this little funnel from <clears throat> walmart so i'm just gonna try to pour this in there guys i'm not a lefty so i think i'm blocking the camera so hold on let me turn this way and try to see if you, can, you guys can see as I'm pouring the glycerin in there. So I'm just gonna pour. Okay, so there you have it. Your strong lightning glycerin. This will give you about a shade or two and it will help your products penetrate. It will moisturize your skin. It will clear off dark spots. Oh, I think I forgot. Let me get the paper napkins to clean my hands. Because I am very extra and I don't want a half filled bottle, I want a full bottle. I am going to pour some more lightning glycerin just to top it off so I have a complete 200 ml bottle of glycerin. Okay, so I'm gonna pour. Um, some more crystalline glycerin in there. I need the funnel so I don't spill it because I'm very clumsy. <laughs> okay, a little bit of crystalline glycerin and a little bit of fair and white glycerin. Uh, 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 uh. 
that is perfect so this brand white glycerine i think i had a life on this glycerine before i got this glycerine from um mitchell brands it's about 29 or 28 dollars it was first 50 dollars but i think it's on sale so i don't know if it's still on sale so this is my glycerine right here whenever you want to use this glycerine you will shake it so everything is nice and incorporated in there get a good mix and then you apply it on your body when to use this glycerine okay let's talk about that you need to use this glycerine um after you scrub your body before you apply your lotion it's a very long process hear me out so how do you use this glycerine when you do your scrubs when you scrub your body, when you exfoliate your body, you come out of the shower, you first of all take your carrier oil, a good moisturizing oil, either sweet almond oil or any oil like that, you apply it on your skin. Then you apply this glycerin on your skin. Then you apply your lightening lo mixture lotion. <laughs> Mommy T said we have time. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> uh, I, I might want to go get my charger because this phone i think i'm running on about 10 percent now you guys let me go get my charger because we're gonna be here a few more minutes i'm so sorry i'll be back I got the charger ready so I just need to plug it in here if I can make it girl I am my eye stumped I the charger dropped on my my big toe it hurts is it charging let me see if it's charging okay it's charging thank god all right okay back to it so you have to layer this glycerin on your skin so you put when you exfoliate your body get out of the shower get scrub your body dry off you apply any lotion any um oil either coconut oil today is girl it is so extra today Ugh, i'm just all over the place you apply your coconut oil or your sweet almond oil carrot oil Olive, any oil that you want just to lock in moisture on your skin then you apply your glycerine then you apply your lotion but this glycerine you should always apply it before you apply your lotion i will advise that on the days that you're using your lightening lotion always apply this glycerine then you apply your lotion that's how you use it okay you guys can ask me questions i would love to answer there was one person that wanted to know about Kara white are you still on i don't know if they're still on oh you guys please follow me on instagram I pinned my my Instagram ID on there. Um, I was thinking that I should start like a WhatsApp group or something like that. 
um so whenever i post a picture we can go on there and if or i don't know if you need something if you need to talk to me privately that you cannot put it in the in the general video because i cannot say you can ask me questions there because i need the comments on my videos guys please share 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 if you've not subscribed to this channel please subscribe let's get to 500,000 subscribers before the end of the year um the next thing i wish i wanted to show you guys will be the stuff that i got from burlington okay let me show you the stuff that i got from burlington this has nothing to do with skin lining but i'm so excited i'm gonna show you anyway <laughs> so i got this underwear it's so nice so this is a set of like lingerie it's super cute it's magenta it was a good deal it's 11.99 so it comes like with the bra and then it has like a like some gaiters this is why i bought it it has like gaiters on it these are the gaiters and then it has the underwear you know what nobody asked me so i'm just gonna move on to the skin lighting issue <laughs> I was so excited I had to share. I absolutely had to share that. <laughs> yes, Mommy T, you get it. Get that action in that. Okay. Um, so if you're looking for stuff to maintain, Burlington is a great place to start. Mommy T, it was $11.99. It was such a good deal. Such a good deal. Especially the it's a three-piece. It's a three piece, the gaiters, the underwear, and the bra. It was such a good deal. So, um, while you're using all of this lightning stuff, you need to maintain your skin. Sometimes you need to you need to take breaks, not even sometimes. You need to take breaks as often as you can. And you need collagen lotions. So this is something that I'm I'm starting to get into. Well, I've always gotten into it but i'm really getting into it into it right now yes they have gators mommy t um nash tab says i'm here girl will i be able to achieve your skin conventional with using carat exfoliate lightening products okay i'm gonna get to that let me just show off these things and they will round up answering your question but um yeah we'll round up answering your questions okay so you need collagen in your life and when you're into skin lightening you need collagen lotions collagen lotions help to firm your body it helps with the production of collagen it helps give your skin that elasticity that it needs so you don't need any particular type of collagen lotion you just need any type of collagen lotion when you want to use your collagen lotion while you're on your break while you're maintaining please add some oils in it that way you also have a good amount of moisture because this is also moisturizing um this is good for dry skin collagen lotions are very very good for dry scaly skin they're anti-aging this is really really good for your skin so you absolutely need collagen infused lotions collagen lotions for your skin when you're doing skin lightening so you either get collagen lotions or you get the regular uh, drugstore lotions that's the jergens the vaseline the cocoa butter um palmas those good lotions the ole the avinos the um i was gonna say i'm lactin but not really you can also get lubridem lubridem is a very very good lotion for the skin it's so hydrating as well so i'm gonna show you some other serums that i got i am obsessed about vitamin c serums so i got two <laughs> <laughs> even though i already have like four already but i get excited every time i see new serums so oh i forgot about the price this was 4.99 and it has 444 ml of lotion in it so that is a good good deal oh you have eczema yes you need this lotion in your skin it works for um blemishes as well and skin conditions it will like i know that eczema makes your skin super duper dry so it will really really moisturize your skin that's skin food right there okay so i'm gonna show you two of my vitamin c serums that i got so i have one vitamin c serum that i always that i swear by is from um elasta lift elasta fit elasta lift 
it's either on amazon or you can go to burlington or whatever you'll find it there should i go get it let me know if i should go get it or i should just tell you guys about it so this is a one this is another vitamin c serum that i added from burlington i got this today i got it for 6.99 this is from spa life so it comes with a dropper uh it's sealed so i'm just gonna try to break the seal and try to open it uh hold on you guys how do you take oh good i have a knife right here hey <laughs> okay so it's not watery i have seen serums that have like watery consistency which i'm not very pleased about i love when my serums are a little thick you see this like a little thickness to it i don't like watery complex uh consistency serums and i noticed that um advanced clinicals the serums are like water they're just so drippy i don't like it i have a couple of advanced clinical serums that um i need to do a giveaway for my people in the u.s i feel bad because i know that i have people that are not in the u.s as well hi grand city you guys that's my sister right there that's my cousin <laughs> <laughs> all right so the next one is still a vitamin c serum but this one is a morning boost this is from 310 ca it's an am boost vitamin c i love the bottle it has this dewy cloudy bottle um so it says skin renewal treatment it perks up tired dull skin it locks in moisture and balances and brighten this is what it looks like let me see it's also a dropper but then you have this little button that you push to get like products in there into the dropper it's very thick which is exactly how i like it mm, smells so good that smells really really nice so it has rose hip oil in it it has glycerin um let me see another important thing that it has it has vitamin c of course it has niacinamide vitamin b3 it has vitamin b5 it has dead sea minerals in it it has jojoba oil so this is this is really good um my one problem with buying serums and um girl no mm -mm. just go to burlington or one of these stores you could they're the plug they have really good stuff so my one problem with serums from burlington and all these other retail stores is they're like a one hit wonder like you get there you see them and poof they're gone so when i get them i try to look for like the websites and stuff where i go find them on amazon so this one smells really good i didn't get to smell this one so let me smell this one and see it has absolutely no smell which is even better so the next one will still be from the same brand as the last the 310 ca this is undergo hyaluronic acid this is hyaluronic acid rejuvenating treatment it says that it combats dryness dark spots enhances skin natural glow improves texture and tone so this is what it looks like right there mm. okay so i love that it's pink let's see some of the ingredients i need to bring this camera closer i feel like you guys can see me <sighs> okay so some of the ingredients are it has vitamin b3 it has niacinamide it has argan oil it has linseed oil um it has glycerin um that's it so it says apply after cleansing and toning apply three to five drops of serum um and this in by dispensing into hands and pressing onto the face and neck area you can do this morning and night but um if you have to do this make sure you wear sunscreen right after that so the next product that i picked up i'm so excited about this one you guys can tell i'm probably you, you can possibly tell that I'm, I'm getting tired so i'm gonna pour myself some 
something to drink again my bottle is almost empty okay wait let me see okay that's way better i was kind of like tilted on the chair okay so the next one that i'm gonna show you i'm so excited about this one this is a trio this is from by natural infusion this is a trio um it was about 9.99 it has collagen hyaluronic acid and retinol so you have to use them all at the same time so you start with a the collagen then you apply hyaluronic acid then you apply retinol in that order okay so these are pretty much standard products right so you already know about collagen and hyaluronic acid and retinol so the next one will be some more hyaluronic acid what do you know okay so this is it this one has rosehip oil and it is hyd uh, hydrating face serum i took this because it smells nice it smells like baby powder and the bottle is pretty and shiny so i wanted it don't judge me <laughs> the next thing that i got was rose oil and i will sh tell you when to use rose oil when to use some of these oils that i'm going to show you right now so this is rose oil as you can see there are rose buds in it it is strictly rose oil and a few more things which i will find it has glycerin in it it has sunflower oil in it it has rose hip seed oil it has lavender oil in it and vitamin e so this is a very very good oil for your skin and i'll tell you how to use it in a minute okay so the next the last one will be your argan oil very smart i'm trying to keep up and my watch <laughs> i'm so sorry uh, mommy t but it's okay if you have to come back and watch later so argan oil also argan oil is super good for your skin it's a good moisturizer it's a nourishing oil for dry skin and it gives you a nice glow so if you have dry skin if you cannot find sweet almond oil go for argan oil it's it's wonderful and so it has um sunflower seed oil in it it has um let's see olive olive oil in it it has a uh, vitamin e in it so you saw one of cartoons <laughs> uh, good boy okay tt says i should shift the camera okay sorry is that better that should be better right okay so um okay that's all what i got from Burlington. so these oils right here when you see oils like this rose oil argan oil turmeric i have turmeric oil and all these oils i'll tell you why you need these oils so there is a, a body exfoliating process that i call um the moroccan bath so you have to use these special gloves which i'll be talking about in our next life those gloves are very very powerful they're very hard they're very strong on the skin and it is advised that when you use those gloves do not apply any lightening oil don't apply any bleaching product use natural oil so when i do that procedure when i have that moroccan bath and whatever and i really scrub my skin intensively that that exfoliating gloves it feels like it feels like sandpaper but not really sandpaper so it really gets that 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 skin off so when you do that you need very very hydrating oils and this is where these oils come in so you will need these oils you need rosehip oil argan oil rose oil you will need vitamin e and tea tree oil turmeric oil you put all these oils together and you apply it on your skin and you get um you get a good moisture lock on your skin so that's all what i have to show you guys and in all of this don't forget to i don't know why i still i'm still showing this sunscreen even though i had an announcement about this so i need to let me just put it over there i will be tossing it in the trash so you need to get your sunscreen while you're doing all of this so i'm gonna talk we're already at one hour mark i'm gonna talk quickly very very quickly about karawai no not quickly i'm sorry because i did promise you that i was gonna give in-depth information so let me try to see if i can go back and get your question again nash um so you wanted to get to my complexion with using car white and exfoliate with lightening products you were asking so 
first thing is you will not be able to get to my complexion using only caro white because by the time you want to get to my complexion caro white will have destroyed your skin let me explain caro white is a lotion that i would not advise anyone to use it for more than three weeks if your skin is super sensitive and prone to stretch marks do not use caro white for more than two weeks and this is how you use it if it's something that you want to use it too often you can use it as a wash off product you can use caro white in your scrubs when you put caro white lotion in your scrubs oh my god if you're scared of using caro white because it will damage your skin put it in your scrubs use the the caro white cup cream take a good chunk of it dump it in your scrub like you just need sugar or salt and caro white lotion and nothing else just mix them together scrub your body with it and you have a nice glow it's not gonna bleach you per se but it's gonna lighten your skin so do not use caro white for a long time i can tell you how you can get to the skin tone um you can jump start the process with caro white that's what you can do but you cannot achieve the full goal with caro white you can only jump start the process so because i remember you said that you're very dark skin what you can do is i'm sorry my mouth is getting really dry what you can do is um start with a caro white go watch my caro white mixture video um let me see if i can put if I can link the video on there one second I have a caro white video I'm just gonna see if I can link it on there mm -mm -mm -mm. oh okay so I can share it for some reason Hmm. Okay. One second, you guys. Let me see. Okay, I got it. Okay, I got it. I got it. So, um, I'm going to post that in the chat. So, that is the Caro White, the link to how to mix your Caro White or how to use the Caro White without ruining your skin. So, you will use that mixture right there. When you have that mixture, you will use that mixture for two to three weeks, maximum three weeks. And for the first week, you would, when you have your lightening scrub, which if you look down my videos, you also see a lightening scrub mixture. eBay, how did you like the results? um glutathione blanchisseur so i'm i'm gonna come to that mommy t um i'm still using it so it's a little too early for me to tell so when you have your caro white mixture the first week when you've done that mixture in the video that i just put up the link watch the video the first week you also make sure you have your lightening or your brightening or whitening scrub which i do have a recipe for that you can go look for it in my videos Make sure that you exfoliate your skin for one week straight every night for the first week. So the first week, exfoliate your skin every night. And then you apply your Caro White. So to be able to see more results, I will advise that you use the lotion morning and night if you're not stepping out of the house but if you have to step out of the house even if you're going to take the trash out do not use caro white during the day but if you're not stepping outside of your house you can use caro white morning and evening and scrub your skin every day for the first week and now for the second week you use caro white only at night and scrub your skin four times a week just make sure that you're skipping a day it doesn't matter what day you choose just make sure you're skipping a day so you're not scrubbing your skin every day the next thing you need is after your third week stop the product completely 
take one week to moisturize your skin and then find another um a good lotion to pro mix um maybe fair and white and then you have good lotions good serums like glutathione blanchicelle like mommy t just brought up and glute c concentrate i have a live video when i was showing you guys how i was going to mix those lotions which i already did so you can go and find those lives it's titled new products you can watch that video and see all the products that i had those are the serums that i mixed with my fair and white so white so you don't have to use fair and white so white you can use um you can use any base, any lightening um, base lotion that you can afford or you can get your hands on. And gradually, you're going to get there. But you have to be consistent. And when you do that, after a month or a month and a half, you have, to, you have to do a skin peel. You have to peel your entire body. Start with your lower half. Practice how to um, deal with your lower half in my previous video about lightening the nether areas i talk about how to deal with your lower half body to lighten them so it can match your upper half since that your lower half is very slow and very stubborn so deal with your lower half um and then you know lighten your upper half as well and then by a month by a month and a half you have to switch and go to a new mixture because your skin is already used to that mixture but make sure that you are exfoliating during your maintenance stage whether you're using butters or you're using moisturizers make sure that you are still using your lightening or whitening exfoliating scrub so never stop using your whitening or lightening scrub always use those um please confirm your ig handle i have it pinned on can you see it it's pinned in the comments yes that is my ig handle um mohammed that is my IG handle. You can write me on there. And for anyone that is that is on this live that has written to me, I am sorry. Um, I will get to it latest by the end of this week. And I was saying earlier on in this video that for those of you who are in the U.S. and some of these products are on eBay. I know the products that are on eBay that you can get. I know the other products that are not on eBay that the in the my local beauty supply store that if you want um I can tell you the prices and I don't know get it for you we can figure out how we can do it and then you pay for your ship you buy it you pay for your shipping then I ship it out to you that is the only help I can offer and I will I can only do that in my free time um but we will talk about that more um, if you're interested, just write me on IG and we'll talk about that even more. So, guys, I hope I answered your question, Nash. But thanks for it. I appreciate it. You are welcome. I think I saw one of your comments just go. I heard of Fair and White So White, but I can never find the real website, Beauty Supply Center. Okay, what country are you in, Nash? Are you in the US? Because if you're in the US, um, Canada, good, you're in Canada, girl. Go to Meet Your Brands. Let me put that in the comments. Meet Your Brands. They have original fair and white products. That's where I get all my fair and white products. The glycerin, the tubes, the lotion, Meet Your Brands. Just type that metrobrands.com. I'm sure they will ship to Canada. Canada is a neighboring country, so they will definitely ship there. Um, advice on clearing dark feet permanently. So you have to exfoliate your foot, and when you apply lotion, the lotion that you use on your body, use on your foot. When you apply it, put on a pair of socks. Always wear socks except when you're leaving the house when you're leaving the house make sure that you apply your sunscreen on your feet as well and then put your feet in a covered pair of shoes that's how you clear your feet don't go applying super lightning lotions on your feet because the skin on your feet they're very very thin and they're easy to burn so just exfoliating and applying your normal lotion and wearing socks will clear up your skin but you have to give it time um is sunscreen okay to, is hell sunscreen okay to use hell sunscreen i've never 
heard of that before. Hmm. But you can use any sunscreen. There is this myth that sunscreen makes you darker. It doesn't. Oh, gel sunscreen. Absolutely. Any sunscreen you're comfortable with. As long as it doesn't leave you with that white cast, <laughs> you can use it. So, mm, does Fair and White really work that good? I'm new to skincare like four months. Fair and White works, but it does not work on its own. So, mommy T, your skin is still very fresh. So, you, you want to be, you want to take it gradually. When you start using a new product, don't expect to see results for the first one month start expecting your results from two and a half months always be very patient and your products will work so fair and white does not work on its own on its own it's just a moisturizer it doesn't do anything but fair and white is a very good base for um lightening mixture it's a good base when you apply good serums in it it does the job like it executes the assignments to the t but on its own it doesn't do anything it just smells great um what are the lengths of your hair good question oh i wish crystal was here to answer she made this wig but the longest is 28 which is the one in the back i think it is 26 uh, -uh. 24 26 28 yeah that's what it is um for dark knuckles any advice yes i do have a video on how to clear dark knuckles so if you go to my videos you scroll all the way down um i can put the link for you one second this is how you clear your knuckles dun, 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 dun. Okay, that's the link right there on how to clear your knuckles. Okay, you guys. Um, you're so beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> She's like, you're so beautiful. Thank you, Mommy T. Thank you so much to everyone that has been here. I appreciate you guys. Please do not. I'm so tired already. <laughs> Please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Being a YouTuber is not easy. How do people do this? I'm so tired. So um, let's get our channel, a little family, to 5,000 subscribers. Mm, I need to share this link. Please, guys, share the link. Share the link. Share the link. Share the link um, to this live video. It says create a post. Um, no. Okay. Um, I'm seeing a question. Hold on delete let me read your questions here hey next time may you set a reminder so we can bring a wine glass yes girl yes i'm trying to make the live sundays that way everyone is off of work but then i keep missing myself absolutely you guys please like share and subscribe Please, 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 let's get this channel to 5,000 subscribers. I love you all so very much. Um, I am about to leave right now. So does anyone have any last questions before I go? I have one and a half more minutes. We're at 83 minutes. I will be signing off at 85. Um, I feel like I'm forgetting to say something. Okay, drink your supplements, you guys wear your sunscreen drink a lot of water eat your veggies remember if you're not clean inside you're not gonna be your skin is not gonna look nice um mommy tessa says should i do cartoons over fair and white cartoons i have to google that I've, i don't know about that hey lovely is 
mom secret a good serum i have no i've never seen mom secret before but i will try to look it up and see mint mon secret oh mon secret um i don't know i need to come up with a new list of serums for 2020 okay you guys i only have a few more seconds left um for mon secret i have no clue i won't tell you that i know i don't know if it's good or not but i will find out and let you know um i have 20 more seconds to go okay let's just round up you guys thank you so much for being with me do not forget to um do not forget to like share and subscribe also tell a friend to tell a friend remember i am not a certified anything these are just my tips and stuff that i do um, that I share with you guys. Um, Mommy T says, I mean, cut on the cream or fair and white. Um, I would go fair and white. Fair and white is, is high, high end and is better. Um, please, pro mixing jackets and glitter C concentrate clear my dark feet. So I'm sorry that I cannot answer that right now, but when I end this video, Put it in the comments i will go back and answer it thank you guys so much have a wonderful night have a wonderful week and i will see you guys again maybe sunday this coming week bye